Hello guys and welcome back to today's uh, Thrifty Thursday. I'm filming this on Wednesday the day before because I have some stuff I have to do tomorrow. So anyways jumping on saying hi and it's just the small haul this week. Um, I have some thrifted items and a little bit of items from the Dollar Tree so I'm going to share those in a second too. Um, in case you didn't know, Thrifty Thursday is an open collab. You're welcome to join anytime. It's hosted by Sherry of Turquoise Dreaming. And if you have anything to share, definitely make a video. Or if you don't have a channel, leave it down in the comments because I'd like to see what other people like to pick up. You know, whether that's books or fabric or some of the other items. <laughs> so, all right, let's get into this. So my first item here is some train fabric. My dinosaur loving child also loves trains and he wanted a train birthday this year so when I saw this like polyester I picked it up I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with it but if I do like a keepsake journal for him I think I want to use some of this fabric and maybe make a pocket or something for him um with some stuff from his birthday he's turning six I got some of these um Archie's Digest magazines with Betty and Veronica, Jughead. Does anyone else remember these? They were 25 cents a piece. I thought they'd be fun um, to collage with or maybe make pockets out of. These ones I believe are from the early 2000s. Did anyone else read these? I remember reading them when I was really young. Not that I'm that old, but anyways. Um, my mother-in-law found this Santa's Toy Shop book for me, 69 cents, 21st printing, 1979. So we got this. This is um, the Golden Book Company. It's called The Christmas Book. She's kind of worn. The staples are like coming out. It's from 1976 but I had some cool pictures in it. And um, my son picked this out for me, my oldest. So I thought that was kind of cool. He thought that the shaped pages were unique. So he wanted to grab that for mom. I got some stickers. These are actually for my kids. Um, they like to do like watercolor pictures and then add stickers. So when I find some like cute ones, I try and pick them up and for 10 cents, you can't beat that. So we got those. This we have a copy of our own for our own little home library, but I wanted some images out of here to use in a journal. I love the colors. Red, yellow, and blue are my favorite colors. Um, and so I thought how fun would these be to put in journals. So I picked this book up, love that book. Got some paper here, it's like this is ivory granite paper. It feels like resume paper. I'm pretty sure that's essentially what it is, but it was a box for a dollar. And so I thought, you know, that might be great for um, practicing doing some printables. So I picked that up. And then I got this book, which is <laughs> coming apart in true junk journal fashion. I believe it's from 1963. And it had some really cool pictures. I'm going to try, try and bring this a little bit closer to you guys. And then look at those. Awesome little pictures. I love this font up here. So pretty. Let's see. Cheeseburger casserole. Green dishes. Yeah, they were just, I don't know, it was a cool book. And then I got a couple more magazines to use in my Harvested Mag Swap, which I am waiting to hear back from Amy, but I think that she is actually willing to swap with me. So I will be going through and grabbing the images that I want and passing these off to Amy at Doki Doki Forest. So Amy, um, if you're watching this, look forward to a couple other magazines coming your way. I'm going to move these things out and bring over the Dollar Tree items. Okay. So we went a little sticker happy here, but they were so pretty and I never actually go into Dollar Tree. 
I don't live near one, so when I went in one, it was kind of small. I'm going to include a couple clips of my little boy with me um, grabbing some stickers and stuff. I will insert those um, at the end. So I got these. I thought these would be easy to kind of like antique up. Um, and I saw the Florida Lee and I thought of Carrie the Paper Monkey. These ones, same thing. I thought for making them look more vintage, that would be pretty doable. I've gotten pansy paper and pansy um, ribbon, like trim, and so I thought that these would be cool if I do like a pansy journal. I'm not sure if that's actually on my list of things to do, but I do seem to keep finding pansy items, so maybe I should um, consider that. I got um, multicolored paper clips, which I didn't have any. They have jumbo ones too. I'm kind of kicking myself for not buying those, so maybe next time I will get those as well. I got these little summer esque stickers, and these are so cute llamas and cactus. So adorable. Got those. I love fruit. I had to get the fruit ones, cupcakes, birds and butterflies. The butterflies actually kind of reminded me of BB from BB's Closet Creations. So BB, do you have any of these stickers from Dollar Tree? Because if not, they're very you-esque from what I can tell of your style of loving the butterflies. Oh, these are stickers I got for my kids, space, um, trucks and trains, and of course, dinosaurs. Let's set those aside. Um, I got double-sided sticky tape. I wanted to see how the quality is on this. And everyone talks about these, um, the textures on these paper pads from Dollar Tree. So I picked up a paper pack. I think I got one more sticker. Oh, yep, the hummingbirds. So lovely. And I got this um, bag here because I believe here in the near-ish future, me and Heather from Crafters Alley with Heather C. Bye, Heather C. Why do I mess that up every time? I'm so sorry, Heather. <laughs> but um, I think we're going to be doing a swap here in the near-ish future. So I picked this up. It's padded so that way I can load up her goodies in this. And guys, uh, that wraps up today's Thrifty Thursday. So again, leave me a comment with anything that you found this week that you're excited about. All right. Bye, guys. Hey, guys. I'm just popping back on because I forgot to show you a couple of the um, trims that I got. Got some vintage goodness here. I love the colors. I love mustard yellow. And that cute little floral with the lace. Okay, this I believe was everything. So what kind of stickers do you think? Um, owls! Owls? Uh -huh. Spy 